got a new property to go to. The landowners are very nice and told me that as soon as I would step out behind their house, I would see hogs, which is a good thing because I have plenty of these 95 grain TTSX bullets to test out for the barns. And as soon as I got behind their house, that's exactly what happened. I saw hogs. Now you'll see I have deer and horses to contend with, and there's a little trail that leads on over where the hogs are. The problem is, is that the trail is covered in gravel, and there is no sneaking up on gravel. So here I am getting my initial video, and I can see that there's two adults and I think four piglets over here. There's the trail. Uh, fresh on this property. I've never been to it. So I don't know exactly what to go up into. Here I'm scanning left. I see some horses come back and then I realize I really need to take into account where these horses are going to be and where my limits are going to be if they end up running to the left. As I move into position, I get busted by my noise. So here we go. You're going to see me take a break here as the deer come into the background. And roll her as soon as she's clear. Ended up getting these two hogs. They're both adults. They're the only two adults, 180 pound sow and 135 pound boar. So let's take a look at what these bullets did. Uh, this is the 135 pound boar. You can see the exit wound there in the armpit. This is the last frame before the shot broke. Really with those deer in the background, I probably shouldn't have taken this shot, but I got lucky as the bullet deflected downward. Uh, you can see that the bullet went approximately 12 inches. Looks like it probably took out the heart and exited down in there. There was a ton of blood there left on the ground. The sow that was 180 pounds, those are both entry wounds on her side. She ended up getting hit twice. Uh, and you'll see here in a moment that these bullets deflected a little bit more. Uh, I was kind of surprised at how much they did. The first bullet actually deflected upwards, I'm guessing off of a rib or something exiting in mid-body. And the second bullet probably took out the spine and exited there in the neck. But uh, definitely a success, and I'll chalk it up to another good field test of the Barnes 95 grain TTSX. And that's it for today. Have a good one.